There are thousands of apps for your cell phone, but Dr. Jennifer Dyer noticed an area that needed more professional help. There aren't that many doctors in the space of mobile health, and I think there need to be more doctors. I'd, I'd love to see more doctors out there joining me. We introduced you to Dr. Dyer last year as the endocrinologist that tested out a texting program with teens who have diabetes. She's recently taken a leap of faith, leaving Nationwide Children's Hospital to create a diabetes application for smartphones. She calls herself the endo goddess. The app is inspirational with quotes posted. They need to hear you are not alone. And number two is that you can do this. But it also rewards you for logging your blood sugar. When you check your blood sugars four times a day, you get the maximum amount of points. And whenever you develop points within the week, then you get to download a song on iTunes. So you sent me that blue one the other day. Yeah. Dyer is working with Short North IT developer eProximity. With a phone, it's really great because users are walking around, whether they're at the grocery store, whether they're at work, or whether they're hanging out with their friends. A little reminder can pop up and say, hey, did you check your glucose? We tested the app out on a self-admitted phone addict to Emily Troiano, who's also the first to admit managing her diabetes isn't easy. Some days it can get very <laughs> discouraging. Troiano loved the fact you can log your blood sugar and email it. If I had my doctor's email address, I could actually send it to him, which would be good. But she'd like to see a tool on the app to help diabetics at mealtime. The only thing I'm not finding is... Um, you know, carb counting, and um, that that would be a useful tool. The Endo Goddess says the app continues to evolve. I just know that this is really going to impact people's lives. Produced right here in Columbus, Michaela Hunt, NBC4. Oh, here? On your desktop, yeah. We've already done some screenshots of it.